for the peeps to come on. Oops. Loralee Brown. Loralee Brown, I see you. I'm gonna send you some happy mail. Make sure I have your um, address. Hello everyone. Hi Shannon. Hi Maria. Hi Deborah. Hello Rhonda. Hi Vicki. Hi Michelle. Hey Laura Lee. Hey Beverly. What's going on guys? Happy Wednesday. Oh my word. I'm praying for y'all in Florida. Let me just say that first and foremost, I have been glued to my television all day. I got a headache because I'm, I'm, I don't even know what to think, but our beloved Sanibel house is not looking good. It's all I know. Hey, Lisa. It's hard to find me. Hi, Sandy. Hi, Debbie. Hope you guys are all staying safe out there. Um, if you guys missed my Totally Dazzled segment from earlier today, you got to go check it out. I'm calming your mom's nerves. My nerves are shot, and I'm in Ohio, and I'm, like, so worried about our, our my, I got my sister-in-law in Fort Myers. We've been chatting all day. One of my besties is in Northport. Um, uh, our... Sanibel, I doesn't look good, y'all. I don't even know. Oh, Shannon, I hope you're okay. Hey, Elta. Hey, Jane. I got a sinus headache. You know, that's what I'm going to do. I asked Mike if he could pick me up some Advil cold sinus. Um, because my sinuses are killing, especially when it's like the weather change. Um, and I've just been a bum today. I know twice in one day. Yes, Diana, I'm praying for Florida. Um, Renee, my brother-in-law was at our house in Sanibel, but it's got a lower level. And when it first started, I'll show you a video guys. This is right down the street from our house. I think you could see my phone. This is right down the street from our house, like right down the street. This was earlier today. If you guys can see that, okay, oh, hold on. So, wait a minute. This is right down the street from our house. That is a four-way intersection on Sanibel Island and a butt ton of water. Um, so I don't know. Uh, my brother-in-law was there. He just came home two days ago. He did what he could, storm shutters and whatnot. Um, but the downstairs is low, it sits on the ground. And our neighbor there said that there on our street, there's two and a half feet of water. That was hours ago. So, um, I don't know, it's not looking good. And they said it's um, like, it's been bad. Sanibel, Captiva, my two favorite places on, in this planet. Uh, but yeah, I'm praying for you guys big time and you know, from Sanibel to Naples, they're getting the storm surge. Um, so I honestly don't know uh, when we're going to be able to get over there. Yeah, so it's not looking good. I talked to my mother-in-law earlier, and, you know, we have hurricane insurance, but she's like, um, worse comes, it depends on how bad the lower level's probably going to have to get completely gutted. Um and uh, if, if the, something happens with the roof on the upstairs level, um, she said it might be just better to tear it down and rebuild. Exactly, Linda. I'm glad my sister-in-law's in Fort Myers. She's up high in her condo, so she's safe. But she said the wind is like nothing she's ever heard. Um, she said it's, it's, it's like a roaring, rumbling. Her house is shaking. Um, so hopefully people are safe. My girlfriend's in Northport. They're hunkering down in her bathroom right now. So I said, you know what? I'm going to go live real quick. I made Jack something to eat. Um, and I said, I'm going to go upstairs. I need to get away from the TV for a little bit, right? So I'm just praying for it. The house can be replaced. But anyway, we're going to make something cute. Get my mind off stuff. 
Oh, no, Dawn. Yeah, so my sister-in-law had her windows all storm shuttered. My in-laws have their house all hurricane shuttered up, but their lanai and their screen on their uh, pool area probably is going to take a big beating. Uh, and from what I understand, um, awesome, Jasmine, you're welcome. Um, I don't know, Renee, I don't know. Yeah, the wind, I bet, is roaring. So I think we're not going to be able to know. I don't even know if the bridge over to Sanibel Island is working, but yeah, so hopefully, to say, as long as nobody gets hurt, I just, I'm worried about my sister-in-law. She's supposed to come home, you know, Friday. Uh, yeah, I guess Naples, from Sanibel to Naples is what I heard is getting the worst of the storm surge. It's not over yet. And they're saying this is like worse than any other hurricane we've ever had. Like, I mean, it's a beast. Uh, Disney World probably would be good because that's not near the ocean. It'd probably just more, if anything, wind damage. Lisa, you're done with, uh, <laughs> Fort Myers is looking bad yet. looks awful. So I'm still doing Halloween. I haven't even decorated for Halloween yet. Um, my mom is in the house. Your pergola is trying to go flying. Oh, yes. Thank you guys for sparkling. So just pray for everybody down in Florida, guys, because it's scary for everyone. I am not a fan of water, so I can't even imagine what people are going through. Um, you have friends and family. Yeah. Hey, Lisa. Yeah, just be safe, guys. Hi, Tammy. Okay, so I have this board. I'm going shopping. I dipped into my closet back here for some Halloween stuff from last year. And I'm going to work with this. Um, it actually goes this way. So I do want to hang it on the wall. I got this at Hobby Lobby. So it doesn't really matter what direction it goes in. But what I want to do is take this paper from Decoupage Queen. And I'm going to put it off. I'm going to put it like right smack dab in the center. My mom is in the house. Water creeping to the second floor. But oh my gosh, Fort Myers is a nightmare. So, oh, see, that's what we're worried about, especially on Sanibel. Um, I am going to go ahead and just use scissors to cut this. And I'm going to give it this far side over here because. Um, hey guys, I'm just going to do like this. Oh, those are bad scissors. Stuff exactly, exactly. Um, so I'm just hoping everybody, I know my sister is hoping to be able to come home. Um, soon, but she's not sure. Michael is a doll. He's going to stop and pick me up some Advil cold and sinus. Yeah, it's a, you know, hurricanes are a scary thing. I'll tell you right now. That's it's, I love Florida. It's flipping paradise when we're there. I don't know what's going to happen. I mean, I, me and Michael talked about going down there in January or, um, in November for a little R and R. I don't think that's going to happen though, guys, unless by the grace of God, our house is fixable. I, I really don't know. I honestly, God, I just, I don't know. It's us all up in the air. Um, but yes, definitely praying for everybody in Florida right now. I don't care where you live. So I am cutting this off. Usually I don't cut these with scissors, but we're going to cover it up. We're going to make a cute little sign. I, I don't know. I happen to be on Pinterest like I always am. And I saw something and I was thinking today, I remembered that cute little frame. Well, I was digging through my stash and I found this cute little skull. Um, and remind me to go back and look through my comments. Uh, I swear to God, I had a hater on the page the other day. Told me I had too many skulls. And does anybody actually live there? Because I have a lot of stuff. It's like, yeah, go pound salt, lady. Stay away. All right, so I'm going to decoupage this right down into this little area right here. I'm going to kind of seam that off. It should be pretty simple. And anyway, that's all I know. Why are some of my scissors aren't working? That is the strangest thing ever. It's like my scissors just didn't stop working. How are you all doing on this though? On this uh, fine Wednesday? Sharon, I did not find my bracelet. It is gone. So upset. 
Mike was like, no. I'm like, I know. So see how that's gonna look. This is the new decoupage cream paper. I'm gonna keep the sides wood because we're not gonna we're gonna cover that with some florals. Um, and this says spiders. Yes, I do spooky. I don't do gross, gory, spooky, but I do do spooky. Oh, I'm not sure the deal with fires are that all. Oh my gosh, Val. You know it's all scary. Tornadoes, they all scare me. I don't like any freaks of nature, acts of nature like that. Um, they all are a bit terrifying. It stinks because then we can't see your comments. Can't. The comments won't go a swipe away. Let's see if I can do it. I'll even go to blue Facebook. Royal Funky Junk. Let's see. Oh, there I am. I hear me. My comments swiped. Watch. When I'm watching me on my phone, I'm able to swipe. I don't know. I can swipe my comments, though. Rhonda, you're shopping at Hobby Lobby. I have to actually go there. I saw this cool thing. I can't talk about it right now, but I might do it for um, a dinner party um, that I've got coming up, but I don't know. All right, so I'm using Mod Podge and I'm just kind of slapping that on there. And I'm just gonna lay that decoupage queen paper down. This is the bigger size A3, I believe it was, yes, A3. And I'm just gonna press that down in there. And again, it's decoupage queen paper, it's rice paper. You're, you're gonna smooth out any bubbles. If I get a little bit of wrinkles in here, ain't no big deal because we're doing a spooky project with it. So it's okay if it looks a little unperfect. You have to hit the comment bubble and then they will disappear. Thank you, Sarah. I didn't know. I just, mine, mine, I just swiped away. Unless um, the book is doing some updates, which they could be doing because they're always messing around. Do you see how easy peasy that was? That was like easy peasy. No, mine don't swipe either. Really? That's so weird. Um, sparkly mugs are behind me. I did those in my private group yesterday. You have to swipe and hit the comment bubble for them to completely go away. You have to click where it says overview. There's a slash through a square. Oh, there is a new button to get rid of comments. It is in the bottom left with a line through it. Hit that button. Hey, Gail. Okay, so then they must have a new thing going. Why did I put that away? Oh, you know what? Maybe I'll do the other stuff over it. I do have to seal this paper down, and for that, I'm gonna use some Paint Pixie sealer, and I'm gonna use, oh, that finish without the work. Let's try this, this is Meltdown. You know what, let's do the other one. I always know that that works, and it's open. Where'd it go? I'm gonna use Force Field by, uh, Paint Pixie. Tornado Alley. Mine's Shelly, your swipes? Yeah, I guess, I bet you, mine swipe just like normal. I bet you that Facebook's updating things, so some of you might not have that. Some of you will. That's what they do. All right, so I'm taking a sealer, and I am going to go over this, because I want that paper to be nice and sealed on there. I don't want it to lift. I don't want it to fade. And you all, I think that I need to have an auction here soon because I have a lot of Halloween stuff, but I ain't ever going to use it all. As much as I say I'm going to, I just don't have the room. I need to get with Brittany. Oh, speaking of Brittany, I forgot to tell her I was on. Um... um I know we need to get, I need to figure out a day for an auction. I don't know if I should do it, I should do it sooner than later, but I'm so busy with the event coming up. Lots of stuff to prep for that, which I'm so excited for. Now, I did not paint the underside of this white either because I just didn't. 
Um, if you want it to be a little bit brighter, I could have, but it for me and what I have in my head, I'm okay if this looks a little bit more dull and some of that wood shows through there. I'm okay with that too. I love this paper too. Um, try it. I just wanted it to have a background. Uh, Teresa, I was painting um, a sealer over the rice paper, putting a sealer so that rice paper doesn't get all janky. Now this is going to be one of those projects where I got like a, you know, a, a thought in my head and I don't really know where I'm going with it. Uh, the link is not my link tree, but it is White Magnolia Boutique here on Facebook. I have there just posted lives we have delegated like in heaven. I have that there. I always download my videos after I go live and I upload them to YouTube. Yeah, you got to have your other, you can't have all your eggs in one basket. So see how we have that? Now I know it's missing that over there, but I'm not worried about that because I am... I'm, I'm gonna, I have a plan. So digging through my stash, I found this. I think this came from the Dollar Tree last year. I'm just trying to, like I said, trying to shop, trying to shop in my room. Thank you, Catherine, who said that? They like my show, thank you. I love when you guys call it a show. Like I'm a, like I'm a TV star. Um, a wooden chair would be great for perfume bottles. Kathleen, I'm doing good. How are you? So I don't want um, these things on it, whatever you <coughs> want to call these things. Manacles, handcuffs, weird things. <coughs> see. Excuse me. Okay, so I'm just breaking those off. I just want the crossbones, okay? It's just plastic, so you just gotta. I make it work. You're, I'm a star in your book, Lou. You're too kind. You're too kind. Let's see if we could take this off. Of course, we're gonna get. There we go. Okay. So my plan was. Let's see. Um, and my phone is going crazy. I have everybody in there, like my family down in Florida. Um, texting me. My phone has been non-stop. I, I do have glue on my scissors. It's from doing, it's from, I, I, I have so many scissors. I should keep like one for this, one for that. Uh, Carol, they're hanging in there. They're still, they're still cell service. Believe it or not, I've been talking to my sister-in-law. Um, so here's what I have this. Now here's my plan. I think I want him down in the corner. But I don't know, and I have some florals, so I don't know. You know what, let's just do it. Let's put him down first. But I was thinking it'd be cute to put this little hat on him. This hat came from Michael's. Aren't they so cute? They're like those little mini hats. I'm gonna see if I can get on his head. Um, I have you streaming on my TV. Oh, you guys are awesome. You have you streaming on your TV. So these little hats, you could take these apart, and I just, I use these all the time. And you just take off the band. They're just glued on there. And I want to see if I put him here. Okay, so see, I want the hat on him, but I'm going to have to cut. Unless I just go like that and just lean it there like that. What do you guys think? Or should I cut the back of the hat off and bend it like that? I think I, I think I can do it. Lorraine, the concert was great. Um, so I'm going to put him here. Wait a minute. Yeah, I'm going to put him off center just a little bit. But let me think about this. Maybe I want to put my flowers down first. I grabbed a bunch of stuff. I grabbed that. I just had stuff that I had laying around that, you know, I used. So I was thinking about doing this here. I'm praying for everyone too. Bent is great. I think so too. Hi, Rhonda Mama. All right, let me cut this up. Let me just play first. Before we start gluing, maybe that's the best thing. Cut the hat in half. 
let's just see. I don't, because I had him here when I was just kind of tossing ideas around in my brain. And I think I had him. Let's see. I could do that. Or do I want to put him all the way to the corner? I don't think I want that. I think I want him right here. And then I was going to fill it up with some fluff. But then I also have these cool things right here, like these feathers. I was going to stick those down in there. So I'm debating, do I want to attach these first or do I want to attach them second? I'm thinking I should probably go ahead and glue them on now. Oh my gosh, I'm making a mess, everyone. <gasps> Ouch. Hot glue. Hot glue hurts. All right, so if I leave that there, I'm just making sure I got enough room. Uh, yeah, I don't think I want to cut the hat in half. I think that might be bad. All right, so I've got that glued on. And I can even stick some glue down in there. Glue guns are a real pain, right? Hi, Avery. Um, for your dinner, I can't say, Barbara. You guys will find out after this weekend. Message me and I'll tell you, but I can't say it out loud. Oh, a scarf on his head like a pirate. That would be a good idea. Thank you, Barbie. Yeah, there's a... I know, Lord, I should be wearing finger protectors, but I don't. I'm a stubborn mule like that. All right, so if I put him here, I think I can lay this one down here. Just a lot of hot glue. Hello, Mita Rose. How are you? Yes, we all know somebody there. Somebody's got something going on in Florida. All right, so see, I want to put him here. And I think all the other fluff I can stick in behind him. But I do want to see about that hat, which I might have just janked all that up because I put these flowers here. So that's what I'm saying. I don't think before I act, y'all. I think I have to attach the hat first. I think I have to attach the hat. Let me stand up and see if I'm even going to like this. Oh, I think this is going to be really cute. Okay, so i got to start over. I just peeled that off. As you can see, I don't really know what I'm doing. Sometimes this is the whole art of crappy. You guys are seeing me without a plan. I'm just winging it right now the best I can. I'm winging it. Totally... Of course, my glue isn't sticking anywhere. I mean, come on, Lord. Let's do this. Okay, it's sticking there. I'm just sticking wherever I can get it to stick. Okay. This is called crafting on the cuff. It was kind of in the same neck of the woods because you say jack things up. <laughs> Barbie, where are you from? Thank you guys for the stars. I didn't even see them come in. Hi, Kay. Hey, Debbie. You're a Barbara Jean, too. What is everybody's middle name? I'm a Kathleen Celeste. My middle name is Celeste. And my mother-in-law, my husband's mother, she is Kathleen Victoria. Just bend or cut the broom back of head. Hey, Kay. Winging it. This is winging it. Oh, you know what? Did I... I think I actually, I did not. I should have bought a patch yesterday when I was at the party city. Crafting on the cuff is what we're calling it. Okay, so I do have that one down there. Now I need to put this little, no, I need to put the hat on first because that's going to debate, that's going to be. All right, so I have to figure out how I want it. And see, the thing is, is because this is going to be hanging on a wall, so I think I want it just like right there. Right there. So I'm going to squirt some glue down in there. And then I could lift up. I'll let this dry, and then I'll lift up that brim. 
Wendy, I did not find my bracelet. No. Catherine Lynn. Barbara, I was just talking about auctioning off all my goodies. I need to auction off. Put a pa I know. I did see a cute patch at Party City. I might have to go back and get it. Thank you, Wanda. All right, so I'm just holding this there. Let that dry before I go kicking at it. See, sometimes that's my biggest problem when I am making stuff off the cuff is I get um, rushed. Uh, I do have paparazzi earrings on. Indeed, I do. Can you staple or glue the back of the hat to them? I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to glue it. But I'm just holding this here until that glue solidifies. Gosh, you know what I should have done? See, I, I'm not planning this out at all. Um, we should diamond dust him. That would be cute. Should we diamond dust Mr. Skull and Bones here? I know, I bummed I didn't find it. But I'm still hoping that it turns up somewhere. Um, which it might. Never say never. Name my daughter. Kathleen Mary is beautiful. Thank you, Linda, for the stars. You guys are awesome. My grandma, Vancy Denise. Ooh, I like that. All right, so now I'm going to look at how cute it is already. It's really, right? Just like that is cute, right? All right, so now I'm going to attempt to pick this up and just squirt some glue back there to let it get a little bit more traction back there, too. Um... I know, Dawn, well, I was said I was working in my kids' closets, uh, cleaning their, or putting their laundry away for them. I had like a good mom moment. And so, you know, their clothes are packed in there. So maybe it got stuck on something and it's, it, I have to go really look hard for it. So I'm not, I'm not, I have not lost hope yet that it's gone forever. So. Okay, so I think that's on there. That's dry. And you know what? I saw a really cute eye patch at Party City. I might have to go back and get it. Uh, Dinah, the hats come from Michaels. I've had these for a couple years. Seriously, that is, that is cute just like that, is it not? But it's not done yet. I'm hiding in the black hole. What does that mean, Dawn? Are you in Florida? Oh, it's oh, it's high. I thought you said you're hiding. It's high. yeah, it's hiding in the black hole. It's hiding. Thank you, Sherry, for the stars and Peggy, Wendy, Denise. Di yeah, I think diamond dust would be good. Should we do that now? I think I have to do that now before I get started on anything else. Should we add a little sparkle to our little dude? Fine. No, I'm just gonna use my Mod Podge. Could I make a patch for some bling? I probably could. I'm not saying that I don't think I could. I bet you I could. I am going to use a smaller brush because I don't get stuck. Have you still put everyone's thing? I know, right? That's what I was thinking. The, yes, I told, of course, he knows. I We don't hide things from each other. I did tell him. I was bummed. He's like, call the grocery store. I called the grocery store. Um didn't have it. Now I'm only going to diamond dust the top right here. I'm not going to really focus about getting everything and I'm not going to do inside of his eyeballs. I'm pretty much just going to focus around because I think we could put some gems in there or something and make it look cool. So I'm not going to do his, his holes, I guess you should say. So I'm just Putting on a bunch of Mod Podge. I'm going to save one tooth because we can paint that gold. And then I'm just going to, well, I'm trying to save one tooth. Let me get this all sprinkled. There it is. And trying to work. I should have done this first, but. That's all right. Any little bit of sparkle he gets is going to be cute. Am 
right? Now that Mod Podge will uh, fix itself here in a second um, and stop being cloudy where this little dude is just going to sparkle, sparkle, sparkle. He's looking all sparkly. I like it. Good idea, everyone. He can have a gold sparkle tooth. I did save one tooth. I didn't put Mod Podge in that one tooth. And again, I'm not trying to be too picky because when this is hanging on a wall, you're going to see one side of it just for the most part. Get your, get the view that you're looking at from the front all sparkled up. Now, I do want to touch up just a little bit of places right here around his eyes that I can tell I missed. And his nostrils, maybe over here, a little bit there. And then once that dries, it'll look a lot better. It looks a little cloudy right now. But I promise you it will dry clear. I gotta get my tidy tray. I think it's underneath this cabinet over here to my right. I need to dry it. Let me see if I can hit this with some heat. Now that cloudiness of the Mod Podge will go away. You'll see by the end of this video, it'll look pretty good. And I am going to make sure that I have, I'm going to take a stiff, small brush and I'm going to put my glasses on so I can say, and I'm going to make sure that he's got one tooth open. So we could make that a gold tooth. I think that would be cool. Okay. So all these little white parts that you see, those will dry clear and he will just be a sparkly little dude. This looks cool. I'm telling you, this looks just cool like it is right now. So now I think we can go in here and um, yeah, one million outages. I know. Uh, Rula, how are you doing down there? What part are you in? Or do I want to stick this over here? No. I think I want this to be down here. Okay, lift up his hat just a little bit. I think everybody who lives in Florida is going to get some kind of, some kind of damage, you know, or some kind of stormy situation. All right, so I've just got that kind of pressed in behind the hat a little bit. See how we're just kind of building it and building it. And then I had this, I'm going to take, I don't know if I'm going to use it or not, but I have these little things, which I thought would be cool. Yeah, lots of blackouts, which I don't know. See, this is why I'm thinking I should have put this stuff in first, but you know me. I don't do anything the correct way. But see, that looks kind of cute right there. I kind of have it. I'm kind of trying to work. See, sometimes you have to work backwards when you're crafting. I, I just won't, I won't lie. Sometimes you have to work backwards because it's the only way that it'll work. And I don't know if I want to keep that there, but I kind of like it. So I think I'm going to see how I just added that little fluffy piece. You know me here at Royal Funky Junk. I am not a, I'm not in the middle. Yeah, somebody didn't like that I, uh, I in their opinion, I over decorate my house and I have too many skulls. Okay. 
Christy, nobody can check on our place in Florida. They shut the island down. Everybody evacuated the island, well, from what I know of. Um, and they're not letting anybody on the island until the storm surge is over. So nobody is going to be able to get on there for probably the next three days. The whole storm is longer. They said it was like 500 miles wide. It's incredible. Yeah, I will keep you guys posted. I And it made me sad. Like, Sanibel has a like a really soft place in my heart. And um, I posted my bike ride through there just in March. And I was like, please, you know. It's just, we always had a good time when we go down there. It's like one of our favorite pl places to be. All right, so now I'm going to stick another one back down in here. And I could feel that I'm pressing into all that glue back there. So it's probably pretty good. <laughs> See, he just is a funky fun thing. And I do want to give another, I do want to put some of this black stuff um, on this side too, to kind of like frame it out. That's what I say, just keep scrolling. You know how many things on Facebook and social media I see that I don't really care for that I would never do? But here's the thing, I'm not going to stop and tell somebody that I don't like their house. I mean, we live there. People can just suck the life right out of you, right? All right, so I am just putting those in there. I'm dabbing them with some glue. See how we're just kind of making it? It's almost like he's a corner frame. This is per. Ah, oh, thank you, Lenore. Yes, the bike ride. So I, I did a little, a little, uh, I did a little reel on that because I was like, man, that is, you know, such a beautiful place. It makes me really, really sad. Like I got a little teary eyed and I know I get, I'm sentimental like that y'all. So sometimes like I, mean, I kept hearing the news people and they're talking about how it's never going to be the same. And this is, you know, it's just like, Oh, I don't know. Okay. So see, I was trying to make that side match this side. Okay. And if you don't like how low something is hanging, then I could just always take some glue right there. Don't be afraid to use a lot of glue when you're dealing with florals. Cover it up with something. Hey, Lana. Yeah, if you guys missed my life, I'm totally dazzled today. I'll show you when I'm done. I finished most of it. Um, and then I had to go pick up Jack, so I had to put a put the kibosh on it. But I had like two more sections to do. So see, if you want that to stay just fluffy like that, just take a little bit of glue and just dab those little feathers on there and it'll keep that there. Just don't invite, yeah, exactly. Look at how cute that is though already. So see, I feel like he's a little dull over here. So I do have some other things. What do I grab? Oh, I grabbed some spider webs. I found out, I found all kinds of stuff. Ah, thank you, Marie. I don't know. I've just been doing it a long time, I guess. Um, I get an idea in my head, and then I just kind of play around with some stuff. Now, see what we could do to cover up that is I can do it, but I kind of feel like it needs florals. Now, I did grab this, too. I can maybe wrap around here. Let's see. See, you just play around with ideas, and maybe we could wrap this all around to fill in that blank spot and wrap it around his skull and bones. Ooh, I like it. Okay, see how I do it? That's all you do, guys, just wing it. All right, so again, that's why I said glue is like your, your friend. Sometimes it's not, but hot glue will work when you need it to. Oh, that's what I'm saying. Can you imagine what this would cost in a store? Um, truly. Hobby Lobby was the wood. I don't remember how much the wood was. I've had this for a while. Hobby Lobby. Dollar Tree was this. The Hat Michaels. And, you know, I get tons of stuff at the Goodwill. Um, the Goodwill had a lot of... Um, and the Goodwill lately, they had a really cute uh, Halloween stuff. I picked up a bunch of it. Black glitter. I'm thinking a black gem or 
All right, so then I'm going to stroll this around here, and I'm going to just let that sit, and then I'm just going to glue it. See, just glue. Tons of glue. A big glob of glue, and just let that sit there. And then if I have to cut the rest of this strand off, we can. It will be catastrophic in Sanibel. No. And Captiva, too. Oh, guys. I don't even know. I don't know. All right, I'm just going to hold this a little bit longer. Yeah, the good, I need to go, I, say, I don't need to go there. Stop telling me about it. I don't need to go there. I don't need to go there. I have a Goodwill in my room, right over there, right behind me. I don't need, I, what I need is like a warehouse. Or I put this stuff in my basement, but then you know I would probably forget that it's there. So I like to keep it close. Oh no, Kelly, I bet that hurt. And the spider web to the other corner, yeah. So I'm thinking like we could take this and I could wrap it. Okay, I'm kind of digging that. So I think what I want to do is I actually, you know what I might do is I might staple that. Let me go grab my staple gun. Oops, sorry, Bubbaloo. This is a wood frame and it's just like one little piece over here. I'm thinking it would probably be more secure if I stapled it. Let's see if I can do it. Let's see if I can make it work, y'all. I did it. Brilliant. Now see where I stapled it, right there, is hidden behind those, so you don't really see it. Now these over here are getting a little carried away. So you know what you can do is if you feel like it's getting a little carried away, grab your staple gun and I'm going to staple these little black feathers right here behind the hat. So they don't move and nobody is ever gonna see but see how that just fixed that so it's not like hanging all the way over here just staple it but I guess it doesn't matter but at least that's in there it's not going anywhere I think that looks really cute doesn't it who would have ever thought okay so then I have the spider webs I found this cute little Room. I think I got this at Michael's this year, and it says Hocus Pocus Broom Company. I was even thinking we could like tuck that in somewhere up over here. Because who's to say that, you know, but, or I've got a ribbon, I've got some smaller skeletons. I did watch Dahmer, uh, Lenora Netflix. Heck, yes, I did. What about a cute bow up in the corner? Or should I make a big bow up in the corner? Uh, the tattoo on my finger says my husband's name. That's too small. Don't you? Yeah, I don't like that. Okay. I don't like that. I think it needs something substantial up there. Or do I do like the broomstick? I could even tuck the broom coming out here like that. Broom or no? I think a big bow. You guys are asking a lot, making a bow. I don't know. Maybe this isn't, maybe off to the side would be cute. I'll save that for a minute. Loving glitch. Yeah, glitch is pretty good. I also found a couple of these smaller pumpkins, but I honestly don't think he needs them. I also found some purple pumpkins, but I'm not digging... Well, let's try it. We don't know if we try. Maybe some purple pumpkins here and there. Do you guys think I should add purple into this? I'm not digging it. And then I'm going to show you what else I, I got today in the mail. It came in the mail. 
but I'm thinking something big up here. Like, oh, and you know what else I got? Where is that little thing at? Here it is. I thought this would be cute, like popping up over here. It's the rest in peace sign. Now, I'm okay with that. Maybe. I don't know. What do you think? Kind of cute. Maybe over here in the middle. Or do I leave it all off and just keep it simple? I'm thinking like a big bow. The, like, not this, not this, but some kind of black and white bow. What do you think? Like a big bow over here in the in the middle. Um, let's see. I have ribbon. Yeah, I don't like the purple. I, of course I have bling. We gotta finish his bling out. But I can do like black and white buffalo check. Would that be cute with maybe some orange? Let me see if I have any orange ribbon. I've got ribbon. I just might have to go crawl in my closet to find it. The broomstick upside down. I was thinking about that too. So we have that. Yeah, I'm running out of room, y'all. I think I have some ribbon down in here. Hold on. It's probably at the bottom because I haven't used it since last year. Oh, wait. Look what I got. This might be cute. We can do a double bow with that. Would that be cute? And then I could do a spider whip in there with some bling. Let's make a bow. Let's just make a bow and see what it looks like. Black. I kind of like that. We can do, would this work together? I'm not a fancy bow maker. Oh, a spooky frame picture. Do you want to know something, Diane? Wait. Now, this is by no means spooky, but I don't know. I have this old picture frame that we could put up here, but what would I say? Like, put it there. I'd have to put a skull there. Maybe like the Hocus Pocus Broom Company with like a picture of a witch. You like the plane too. Well... I wish I could say the same. I don't do plain. Or we could put that right in the middle of that. Oh, I'm kind of digging it. Not like that. See, you gotta make it original, peeps. I kind of like the gold frame, believe it or not. I don't know. I kind of like that. It's different. An old mirror. No to the frame. See, I'm saying yes to the frame. You know what I could do? All right. Changing scary things. I don't want to see. I don't know if I'm digging the ribbon. If I were to put ribbon on it, I'm thinking maybe a little bit down here. But I don't know, guys. I'm not a bow person. I'm not a bow person. I'm not. I never have been. Okay. I mean, I can. All right. Another goodwill find here. See, sometimes this is why I like doing this kind of crafting because, you know, you just got to do you. Um, hypothetically, I don't need to keep the glass in here. So you guys just give me ideas and then I just kind of, kind of go with it. You know, I just kind of, something pops in my mind. Like I knew I've been staring at these frames. Now, you can take that out to the picture. Look for money because you never know. There could have been a $100 old-fashioned bill behind there. Now, do I want to keep the frame? Or I'm thinking, keep the frame. Hold on a second. Let me get a wood block. Here's what, my, here's what I'm thinking. I 
I'm thinking, I like the gold. I'm not going to lie, I like the gold. I like the gold. But I'm almost thinking of like propping it up like so. Um, let me see. I have to put the glass back in there. Where's the glass? I heard it. There it is. Okay. I need my glasses on. Pick up a dead person. Wait a minute. Oh, yeah. Hold on a second. Wait. I got decoupage queen. Does decoupage queen papers have dead people on them? I think I do have one, y'all. Hold on. Don't go anywhere. I'm pretty sure they have one with a skull. Yes, but you know what? If I do that, then I can't do that. Okay, so here's what I was thinking to begin with. I can always add to that. Let me put the glass in here, and then I'm going to show you what I'm thinking of. Because I don't know. I was thinking... I'm thinking... If I do this, see, this is going to be one of those ones. I, you know, it was started out pretty cool and I would be okay selling it. Now, if it's going in the way that I think it's going to go, it's like, no, I can't get rid of this. It's too cool. All right. This glass is cracked anyway, which is fine. I don't care. So we have that. Okay. So if we put it up on blocks like this and we make it a little bit high, it'd have to go there and here. It probably would have to put two. Let's see. Can you guys even see what I'm doing? If I do this and prop it up like that, I make it bigger, like like three dimensional. I can put the skull behind it, possibly, or this little hickamajoo like that. Oh, I kind of like it. Taking it. Okay, so I think I want to do that. Okay, right here. See, this is how my brain works, y'all. It just happens. Okay, and then that one's going to go at the bottom. Now, I don't... Oops, wrong side. And then you can glue that on there. Actually, it probably needs another one. Oh, let me go grab two more blocks. See, it might be organ it might be chaos, but it's organized. I know where everything's at. Paint cubes. Yes, I will. I'll paint them black because you don't want to see those from behind. I think it's gonna require two though. I'm kind of digging it. I I'm digging it because it's weird. I'm digging it because it's not the norm. It's how I roll. Okay. Then we can paint those black. They would sit like that. Now that's a little too tall. Honestly, though, you know what? I don't know if I like the two. Why couldn't I cut that in half? I kind of like... Just one better. Mm. Of course. Crackle the glass. That glue is some good glue right there. My husband loves my projects. Yes, hold on. I don't think I have bigger blocks. I think I gotta use this little tiny one. Work. I have a huge bucket of like blocks, like wood pieces. 
Diamond dust the glass so it gets a little bit foggy with glitter. Wizard of Oz guy in the mirror. I don't know if that matches. Unless I put it on here, but then you can see it. See, if I put it here, it's taller. But then you're going to see it. Not really, I guess. Let's try it. We don't know until we try. How can I get your fancy coffee containers? My fancy coffee containers? Oh, you mean those tumblers back there? So I made those with my private group yesterday. And uh, I want to put them on the website, but I have to perfect my, I have to perfect my, we have to perfect it. Actually, I think I would paint these gold. Now see, that works perfectly, see? So what I had to do was I had to put it on top of this outer rim. And I think what I'm gonna do is paint this gold. And I could get some, I think I have looking glass spray. Put crackled glass on the, put cracked glass on the glass. Too bad you don't have hands to lift up the frame. I do have hands, I do have hands. I do have hands. Hold on, let me get rid of this because I don't think we're going to be using ribbon. But it's good to know that I have orange and black Harlequin ribbon. Cover those cubes with the same of the... Oh, that's going to take too much work. I'm going to paint them gold like the frame. That's what I'm going to do. That's what this girl's going to do. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. Okay. I'm just going to paint these gold. It doesn't have to be perfect because honestly, you're not really going to be seeing a whole lot of them. You're going to be more or less just getting a little, because we might even, I'm doing this as a precautionary, but we may not even see these hypothetically. And I could go get some of that, you know, it would be cute on here, some of that black. I think I have some still. It's like that black creepy looking kind of fabric-y stuff. Like, it's kind of spider webby looking. Oh yeah, his tooth, might as well do that. Good call, yo. See, my brain goes 100 miles an hour. And I'm crafting. Got his little gold tooth there. Spider web on, that's what I'm thinking. Spider web on the glass would be cute. Okay, so now we take this little thing, and I have to see where I want it. Let's see. I kind of like, although I think this is the correct way. I don't know, I think it looks cool, guys. Although, I, maybe this is the right way. Okay, so I'm gonna put that right. I'm gonna make sure I gotta center it just right. I think it's really cute. Okay. So if I just leave that there, so I'm gonna take a pen and I'm just going to mark where this is, so I know to, that's where it's gonna get glued. And I'm just gonna take a bunch of glue. Like so. And make sure that that's right. Like that, and then that can just get glued on right down to there. Um, somebody asked about my jeans. My jeans are from Amazon, and you can find them linked on my Amazon store.
see, it's just cute. Oh, good, Lisa. Okay, I, oh, it's sliding. We don't want it to slide. Just let that sit. Okay, Kathy's gotta like give it a minute. I get impatient because I want y'all to see it. I'm digging it. I'm digging it. Okay. Now what? Now we can take that little spider web thing in the jigger. We can even take this little thing. That might look cute. How did I have that before? See, now I don't remember how I had that. I don't even think we need the broom anymore. I mean, you could if you wanted to, but this little spider web could go up here in the corner. I don't know if we can use the, I don't know if we need the broom anymore. Or I could put the spider web back there. I think I like the spider web back there. So let me just glue them right there. Okay. I think this is good for me to pick it up and show you guys what I got so far. I think it looks so good. See, I like weird stuff like this. I like I like things that you wouldn't normally see somewhere else. Now, I do think it's a little bare down here, so I can take and I have these little skeletons too. See, I'm trying to go through my stuff. Oh, I just broke his body in half. That's weird. How the heck did that happen? Oh, I see. But you can even like set one of these little dudes down in here on this pumpkin, but I don't like that either. But I do have other little pumpkins we could stick in here. Hmm, I don't think I like that either. Well, just a little bit smaller. I say, I have these too. I have these, um, let's see. What is this? That's garbage. I have, where did it go? I have those purple pumpkins. I don't want to use those. That I don't want to use. I have these chains we could use somewhere. See, just make it fun and funky. Um, place in town. My friends and buildings are blowing up there. Oh my God, Vicki, I don't know. I know we have, it's bad. I know it's bad, but I don't exactly have any firsthand witnesses because nobody's there. So it's going to be a couple days before we could get there. I bought these at the Party City store. Now this would be cute with like a little bit of bling. Um... Yeah, I think it's fun. Now we have big spiders here. Like a big tarantula. And I could put another one like over that one that we just did. That might, um, that spider web, or I can use some of that black spider webby stuff. I love the orange, you like the orange sparkly pop? Now see, I could put this spider over there and then we could put bling on them. Okay, so I'm getting, I'm take now this has a blingy spider on it, but I'm going over it with this really fuzzy one because I think this is funnier. It's more creepy looking. Kitty Kirk has, oh, she does some black or orange frame on the frame. Okay, I got ideas. Hold on. I do have other pumpkins. Let me go pull them out. It's weird, but whimsical. Exactly. Okay, so this spider... I should put this in my husband's bed tonight. Freak him out. We'll put one in Sam's bed because I'm weird like that. Cut the big pumpkin. Oh, that's a good idea. It is foam. I like the color of it. We could put one another spider over there. 
Did I put it, cut it in half? But then it wouldn't really look like a pumpkin. Hold on, I got some orange small pumpkins in here. Hold on. hands. So I have these pumpkins. These could probably work. I think it just needs, hold on, let me hold it up. Let me look at it. It needs bling now, but I kind of like this spider right here on the frame. So I'll show you what I got. And then we can add these little things. Put the spider over his eye. I'm going to put a pearl in his eye. See how I just did that? Oh, this is adorable, y'all. Okay. So I'm thinking, could we add a little pumpkin right there? Or does it need it now? I kind of, if we fluff that out, we filled it up, do we really need it anymore? Maybe one over here. About like one over here and then maybe one over here because they, they even have some really tiny ones on here had two little pumpkins so we could put one there let's put the smaller one over there maybe put this one over here okay i like that see i'm going with it Starts to make sense. Oops. And then that one's going to go right there. Kind of like that one right there. It looks like Halloween. Hallelujah. It's definitely Halloween-y. Now we need to do bling. It needs some bling, bling, bling. I like it to be awesome. No sparkly in the left side. Seriously, for something that, that was just a piece of wood and a skull. Oh my gosh, this is so adorable. So see, the spiders need some bling. And then I think we're done. So, oh, and I have hands. Bling hands. Well, I got bling. I do have bling hands, but then I also have these bony looking hands. Um, where's the bling hands? And then I have smaller bling hands. Um, I don't know if I want to use the, those blingy hands. Now, what I could do, hmm, I don't know if I like the hands. Where would the hands go? It doesn't make sense. Where would the hands go? Like creeping out over there? Or like holding the frame up underneath here. I don't know if I like it. I don't know if I like it. I think it's weird. I don't know. I think it just needs some spockaliciousness. Hands on frame. Yeah, I tried. I didn't know if I was digging it. I don't know that I was digging the hands on the frame. Like how? Like underneath yeah I don't I don't I'm not digging it put the hands on the spiders I'll try anything like we could put the hands coming from the spiders holding the frame like this I don't know I don't like it nope I'm done um, like the hands hold yeah um, on the hat no I think we need bling so I do want to take, and I had a whole bucket full of, yep, there they are, hang on. Okay. I have this little pearl eye. I'm going to put this little pearl eye um, in one of his eyeballs. Like 
so. And then I'm gonna put some bling, some gems. I'm thinking some antique bronze. And you know what I could do is use the new antique bronze collection that just came out and do like a little tiny pumpkin on top of the spider. Cause why not? Hands in the flowers. Yeah, I don't like the hands. I'm past the hands. I'm not digging it. Or I could take these little, ooh, these little skull heads and put those on the spider. Let's see. That would be cute. I gotta get another one though. I don't have another skull. What else do I have in here? Hold on. I got my bag of goodies right here. Let's see. So this is there's another skull in here. Okay, hold on. I gotta clean my craft room. We could do a, a spider on a spider, but I don't like that idea either. I kinda like the skull in the spider. Because why not? I mean, who cares? You can do whatever you want. Um, but it kind of like all goes in line. Should we do the little... Um, what do you think? Should we do the skulls on the spider? You tell me. See how I have them tucked up there? Or should I do just like a piece of gold bling? Just plain gold bling. See what else I got in here? Mm, there's a spider. I don't want to do a spider on a spider. Have little apples, little pumpkins. Put rubber really up on the skull mouth. I can't, that's already been diamond dusted. Or should I just do little bits of, hold on, I have black blue. No, that's silver. I'd have to do like, or you know what might be cute, guys? Just um, a little tiny pearl. Do you think that would work? A little tiny pearl. Skull looks cute on spider. This is my mom calling me. Hold on, let me see if I can take this off. Let me see. No, I don't like that. I don't like that. I, I kind of like, let's just do the skulls and then be done with it. Yes, these are, Kathy. Yes, I wear my jeans over and over again. I do. I was even thinking we could put little bow ties. Oh my God, we could put a little bow tie. A little bow tie on the, on the skull, on the, on the snake, on the spider. How funny would that be? I do have two of those little bows, tiny sparkles on spider. I kind of like, see, I'm going for it. I keep going back to the school. Make skull look 3D on the frame. Make skull look 3D on the frame. I don't know what you're saying. Make skull look 3D on the frame. How do you do that? What skull? I'm making them skull. Ian took the oath from our coast up north. I heard that it was going back out. Paint skull gold to be cute. Paint what skull? This one in the corner? He's already diamond dusted. We can't do anything else with him. He's done. I think this is it, y'all. Spider calling up the mainframe at center. Bow tie on the spider. Is that would be oh that would have been cute little bow. I didn't do it. I ended up doing the the skulls. They're like his spider skulls. Um now you know what I could do is I could take that little bow and I could put one. Oh yeah, I'll put one on the spider, the big spider on his hat. Kind of like that. 
Oh, I can't lift that up. That's in there. That's that's not going anywhere. Nope. Come on, I gotta find that little. There it is. Oh, there it is. That skull is done. It's 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 glued in there. I can't touch it. I mean, why not? We could put we could put bling wherever we want. There's no right or wrong, but I am gonna put one like a Beetlejuice spider over here. Okay, so that's all on there. Oh my God, this is really cute. See, I can't sell this. I can't. Seriously, it's so cute. I love it. I love everything about it. I think it turned out really cute. Can I have? Oh. Oh, yeah, I have diamond dust on there. I think this is darling. I don't know, guys. This is the kind of weird things that I like. So, and I'm just trying to throw stuff together that's left over my craft room. Um, I think he's cool. Do I put another eyeball in him, though? Another eyeball might be cool. I kind of like the idea of him having another eyeball. Why? I don't know. But I do. Let's see if I can find one. somewhere. I know they're here. I just don't know where they're at. I'm glad you all like it. A little rhinestone on his gold tooth. I can do that too. But I don't feel like it right now. Oh, and I really wanted to use this Hocus Pocus broom company somewhere, but I just don't think, I think we're just going to have to save that for another craft. I did paint his tooth gold, Susie. See, I think another eyeball, too, would be cute, but I don't have another eyeball, unfortunately. Um, I do somewhere. I've got stuff coming out. I've got everything everywhere. Guys, it's so bad. I need work. Who would have ever thought Royal Funky Junk was going to, you know, take off like it did? I didn't. Um, let me see if I could find one more. Hang on. I got a whole jar of pearls, but I don't see a big one. I'm lucky I have that one. I do, I promise you though, I do have them somewhere. I just gotta dig them out. I think it looks great. I know I actually have some in my closet. So there you go, guys. And look, I just kept this the same. I didn't even touch the frame. And that's why, you know, that decoupage queen paper, you don't even notice that we were short cutting it. This is really stinking cute. And it's like, you know, one of a kind. I love it. This is why I have a hard time selling my stuff. I think I need that in my life, says Lisa. If I can find one, I will. If not, oh, and see how most of his um, Mod Podge is dried up. See how he's just sparkling now? He's got a couple of spots that are a little heavier that's still going to dry a little bit more. But you can see, and we didn't even have to add anything. The only thing that I think that I would add onto this, hypothetically, would be maybe... A pumpkin in his hat. Mm, I don't know though. Let me try it on the other side. No, I don't. See? That's why I tried it. I don't think so. I think I like it just like that. So I will take a picture. I'm going to take the skull picture downstairs right now. And, um, and, uh, get it online for you. I need to clean my craft room because it's a hot mess. Um, and tomorrow I'll come on. I don't know. I got a meeting with Chris in the morning about the event. And look what I got, guys. I got the door knocker for that antique thing that I re so, that I redid. So I'm going to put some rub and buff on him and then um, glue that to the top of my... Grab, glue that to the top of my uh, um, scuttle thing down there. 
Thank you, Claudia. Anyway, thank you guys for hanging out with me. I got a headache. I'm going to go make something to eat. I'm going to take this downstairs. I will um, keep you posted, guys. Um, in the morning, I'll let you know what time I'll be on. Tomorrow's Thursday. I know I got a meeting. I think I got stuff on my account. I just don't remember. I got girl Janice. I know mine is horrible. I get, I, get, I feel your pain, sister. I do. Um, uh, I need to clean mine, but you know what? Creators, uh, are messy people. I'm not a messy person, just my crafting space. And it's only because I don't have a lot. I, I, when I built this room or when I get, took over this room, I made it look pretty instead of functional. Now it's a hot mess. And now I wish I would have done it the other way around and made it functional, but I didn't know. Oh my gosh. I'm going to go watch the news too, Dawn. Right, Isla. All right, you guys are awesome. Please stay safe if you're in Florida. Make sure um, you keep us posted on what's going on because we're praying for you. And um, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Fingers crossed. Have a good night, everyone. Bye.